John Eats Cheap doing, uh, we're actually cleaning out the pantry, making some oyster stew. Now I know, I know, oyster stew I always do from scratch with fresh oysters. We do it every Christmas season. But we had some leftover canned oysters and when I was a kid, my dad would make oyster stew with canned oysters and it was just like a couple cans of oysters and you know, a quart of milk and that was oyster stew. Yeah. Don't like forget to, to throw butter in the end. Yeah, and butter at the end. But uh, <laughs> we do it a little more like the fresh way. This is an Emerald Lagasse recipe that this is based on. So instead of fresh, we got the extra can, cleaning out the pantry, a couple cups of milk, butter, and we make a roux, and that's really it. It's nice and fast. It's pantry stuff, and it's very tasty. Let's get started. All right, so a small batch, this is all the liquid I got off of the cans. That's a lot of liquid and that has a lot of oysters. This is gonna be some really oystery, chunky oyster stew. I mean, we're good with that. All right, so our half stick of butter is melted, two tablespoons of flour, and just make a roux. Cook it for a couple of minutes. Get it all incorporated. So our roux is ready, cooked a few minutes. Try and get all this liquid in here without spilling. Just whisk it in. Let it thicken up a little bit, and then we'll add our milk. So that is really thickening up and smells oystery. We're going in with our milk. I'm just gonna add about a cup of the milk to start. Not quite all of it. Let that thicken up. I'm still on uh, about medium low heat, medium low to medium. Thickening nicely, a little more milk. I'm still not gonna add it all yet because I might not use it all. There was a lot of liquid from those canned oysters and I want it to be fairly thick. This may be about it. So it may be only about a cup and a half of milk. And of course you could use half and half too. That would be really good. We don't have any handy, but extra creaminess, but we're gonna add butter at the end too, so. All right, so now I'm gonna add my seasoning. I'm gonna add some salt, kosher salt, freshly cracked black pepper. Yeah, I'm Somebody cheating. Somebody likes their toy. I'm cheating <laughs> and I love this thing. I always, I always poo-pooed fresh cracked black pepper, but it was because it hurt my wrist. <laughs> I love this thing. And it does make a difference. So the pepper is in. We're gonna add a little bit of, you can do fresh minced garlic. I'm just doing granulated garlic. A little bit, not too much. And a little bit of cayenne, just for a little bit of heat. Just about that much. We're gonna whisk that up. It's nice and thick. Don't let it scald on the bottom. We'll add our oysters and we will be ready to go. By the way, this is where the season to taste comes in. You need to taste it if you're seasoning to taste. That is excellent. Nice. I think we're ready to add our oysters. Again, this is three cans, probably could have been two, but we're good with extra chunky oyster stew. Well, oh, that rhymed, it was almost a haiku. <laughs> I'm gonna do a little more cracked black pepper just cause I have it. So we're heated up, we're seasoned, we're nice and thick. A couple tablespoons of butter for presentation and flavor. Take it off the heat and we'll be ready to bowl it up. Oyster stew. That was quick, it was easy, it was out of the pantry, and it is oystery. Nice and thick the way I like it, not the way I had it when I was a kid. It was tasty. I like a little more body to my oyster stew. Give it a taste test. We don't have any oyster crackers, we just have regular. I'm gonna do my taste test without the crackers though, just to make sure. Oyster, uh, the stew part.
and that's not as good as fresh, but it's really, really close. Anybody remember when Campbell's Soup had oyster stew? I don't think they have it anymore. But here's a way to do it quick, cheap, great oyster flavor, and clean it out the pantry with Johnny's Cheap. Give us a follow. We're on TikTok too. Also, uh, Instagram and Facebook. Check in, give us a thumbs up, a like, a share. And thanks for watching. We're ready to eat some oyster stew on a chilly spring night with Johnny's Cheap. Thanks for watching.